Welcome to my project buzzer. Now the project title is Energy Efficient Dynamic Spectrum Access Protocols for Cognitive Radio Networks. In this abstract we use uh, Dynamic Spectrum Access Protocol for secondary user communication over a single primary user channel. In the Dynamic Spectrum Access Protocol we have uh, two key aspects. One thing is to maximize the utilization of unused primary user channel and the energy efficiency operations of the secondary users. While reduced secondary user packet size may increase the utilization with the limited interference to the primary users. To evaluate the protocol performance in terms of uh, secondary user throughput, energy efficiency and the primary user collision ratio. Uh, secondary user maintains a lookup table uh, complemented with the pattern search algorithm to uh, provide a quickly adaptive optimal operating parameters in dynamic traffic conditions. In this data flow diagram, the main role is a secondary user and the primary user. Uh, first of all, uh, the source user sends the packet. Uh, th these packets are split into the multiple packets, multiple small packets, and these packets are uploaded into the database. Uh, first of all, the secondary user check the packets um, through the uh, channels, and the channels contains the channel name, protocol, uh, and then the uh, status of the particular channel. Um, so these details are maintained in the secondary user. The primary user um, should verify the channel uh, through the um, users. Uh, so uh, these verifications is uh, uh, under the category of primary user. And uh, after that, the verification and the packets are uh, uh, sent to the destination user. So the source user is send the packets and the same packets are received from the destination user. So in this process we find the uh, secondary user energy and throughput. Now I am going to run our project Dynamic Spectrum Access. So I am creating a package DSA. So click a DSA package and click a source package also. I uh, click a um, DSA package. In that package we have a lot of Java files. Uh, first of all, the home page uh, we run uh, home page dot Java. So right click the home page dot Java and click uh, run file. Another process. In that process we have the main frame. <laughs> so click on that image. Okay. In this process we have two users. One user, is secondary user. Second, second one is primary user. First of all, we are going to process the secondary user. Uh, now click on the secondary user button. Uh, in this type message, uh, the source user send the message. So we have to type uh, some content uh, here. So in these contents are create the packets. So click uh, create packet. Packets are created. Okay. Next, click the next button. In that process, uh, we have to optimize the packet size. Okay. Now I am going to brow click a browse button. Uh, click a message.txt in that file we have to um, already store in the message uh, type the messages like that okay this message uh, this packets are split into multiple packets so click a split packets uh, number of packets are split okay now these packets are uploaded into the database so click uh, upload packets choose all the files open and these packets are uploaded into the database. Click OK. Click next button. <coughs> we have a secondary user. In the secondary user, uh, uh, we have a lot of uh, channel list. So click the uh, channel list button. Uh, in, this cha in this channel, we have a lot of channels uh, uh, having a protocols uh, and then connections name and um, transmission protocols and then location address and status also. Uh, we have to um, choose the uh, um, channel is uh, only ideal. Ideal channels we have to choose. So click ideal channel and giving the priority. 
so uh, i click on idle idle channel and click a priority so this channel is having a priority and third channel is having a priority so we have to process uh, send the messages through the uh, channel 3 okay click on next button and the send packet to the channel and view the selected channel channel is uh, channel 3 we have choosing the uh, channel 3 and send the packet packets uh, through this channel so click on next button we have to process the now we are going to process the primary user in the primary user verify the channels and packets also click a verify channel button so verify success um, the packets are um, um, going through the channel 3 so send the information to the destination user um, ok send success click the ok button click on next button so fi uh, file receiving button uh, choose now packets are received from that uh, uh, primary user now uh, we have to going to download that file yes receive message success ok mm, click on next button in this process uh, we have to um, we have to find out the energy efficiency of the primary channel and secondary channel and the best uh, and the best channel is uh, secondary channel so we have to process this voice that's all thank you